Ana changes. This is an exciting little change, actually. Yeah. Ana Finally, changes. support players rejoice. Ana buffs. Yep. Biotic Two of rifle. Them. Damage and healing increased from 70 to 75. Yeah, so that's a, there's that's definitely chunky. some break there's some break points there that, that definitely helps her out with, right? I, I think one thing when we look at supports and we look at how we want to buff them currently, I, I think there's something we always worry about. We buff their damage too much, we buff their healing too much, they could become these these heroes that play a lot differently. Like too much healing in the game creates a lot of different dynamics in terms of our our things actually dying when you're shooting at them. Uh too much damage on support changes their dynamic in the whole team game that we have. Uh, but here we did think there was room. And we did think there was room for Ana. This is going to help her out in a lot of situations. Especially, uh, you know, if you do need to be aggressive, you might actually be able to take something out if they're at 225. You know, so I think that's going to help a little bit. I like the change on Nade 2 to 3 to 4 seconds. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. It, I think the change with Nade was like as Kiriko came in, right? Um or was it from the beta? That was two? in the beta. I don't remember. It was during the beta because it was a lot was, of the stri- Yeah, it was during all the antis. But now that yeah. Cleanse is in the game, mm-hmm. uh, it, I think this makes Nade feel a lot more impactful. Because, I mean, at least in my POV, like, because we've been playing a lot of Hog recently, right? Um, you know, even if you managed to Nade the Hog with, without Suzu right now, it actually didn't feel like that impactful as opposed to what it used to feel. So, really mm-hmm. excited to, you know, because, you know, we're not going to get the, the changes because they're not ready yet for Hog. Um, but I think this change alone actually will be pretty massive because there is better counterplay. Even like, you know, you Suzu will still cleanse it, but you bait out the Suzu, that window of punishing whoever gets anti is going to be much bigger now. I love this. Yeah, overall, we just want to make sure ports feel impactful. Um, so there's going to be more changes. I think midseason has a few more changes for support, uh, even if it is a light patch. But this one, as you just said, you know, when you land the nade, what's it going to feel like? You're just gonna feel better as the Ana player uh, on both sides of it. Landing on your on your folks, landing on the enemy team, it's gonna feel a lot better. Yeah, it's a good change. Yeah, that, very good yeah. change. Supports have definitely needed it too. So to, see, to hear mm-hmm. there's gonna be even more support changes like towards mid season, I'm I'm sure supports are gonna be happy to hear that. Cause yeah. There's definitely some changes on that. And then we go to protection Suzu, which has been interesting because Suzu's been it's so strong. Uh, yeah. So the invul- invulnerability duration i just uh, reduced from <laughs> one to 0.85 seconds i listen i got stuck halfway through saying the word and i just i went with it okay i just i went with it and you gotta commit You're at that point dude. it's a tough word from, from, well no i i can from one to 0.85 <laughs> seconds yeah so this is really light um this is a very minor change in, in our eyes at least <clears throat> but overall i'll say you know, we're still still want supports i think people have been calling for the nerfs to some of Kariko's kit, but we want supports to feel good. We want them to have you, and we, we we think her E here is is feeling really strong in that sense, and it feels good to play as Kariko. You know, you have a lot at your disposal. So if anything, um, rather than you know nerf some of our supports are pouring well, we want to get some of the other ones up to their level in terms of feeling you know that level of capability. Uh, but at the same time, it's pretty good. We're tuning down just a little bit here, and um, this is like so that involve state after. The, the initial impact is, is going to last a little bit less. Yeah. I, I think something important you just said is because um, support right now is, is kind of the hot topic for a lot of people and making sure it feels good and feels impactful uh, is very difficult to balance with like, you know, uh, with, with how strong something like cleanse is, you know, if you're, if you're heavy handed on nerfing it, like you're going to take away a lot of her power at that point And like, and beyond that, just fun to play. Um, mm-hmm. But I, I I like the route you're going is like being very, very delicate with, you know, how things are changed, but recognizing like, you know, there needs to be some small changes, but, you know, want to monitor it over time and bring everybody up a little bit. I think it's good. 